Right. We live, we live, we are live. Happy Thursday to everybody. I really do want to apologize to everybody. I know we were supposed to do episode seven and episode eight, but you know, episode seven, uh, Vicky, you know, she got uh, sick, so you know, we're hoping she gets better, so we'll hear from her soon. And then episode eight, uh, Vic, uh, we were we tried to we tried to do episode eight, but we were having signal problems with Vic, and we were supposed to do it like sometime this week. And I guess we just both never had the time to do it. But the good news is that we are doing episode um, nine today, and I just want to thank you guys for tuning in. Who's in here? Only one person. Shout out to Randy Hernandez, who's also going to be a guest here um, on the show. Uh, so today, guys, we have my guest, uh, Pure Flow, you know, rapper from uh, Arizona, uh, Mesa, Arizona. And yeah, you guys already know the vibes. You guys know why we're here. We're here to talk about shoes. Yo, what's good, buddy? Shout out to Canada is in the building. Canada is representing, and I'm super excited. I can't wait to have you on the show here, and we're just waiting for uh, Pure Flow. I'm just, you know, hitting. So, yeah, guys, before we begin, though, I do have to say that this video is, and this IG Live TV show is sponsored by N Lime. Yes, guys, N Lime, the greatest brand out there. If you're new here, follow me on Instagram at N Lime NYC. That's probably the other website you see right there. Whoever you guys are uh, visiting, you guys show me some love. Follow me on Instagram. Check out my YouTube channel. I do sneaker reviews and all types of the content. Uh, my YouTube is N Lime TV. So yeah, guys, let me just sit down and, um, what's good? What, what's good? Where you at, Pure Flow? Pure Flow, where you at? All right, so what's good, Randy, bro? How was your day, brother? How was your day? All right, so Pure Flow is in here. Let's go. Good man, can't complain. Had a great day. Yeah. What's up? What's going on? I mean, to to start off, we both wearing purple fitted. Purple. Yours is purple, purple. Mine's is like like that wine. Like a violet. Yeah, definitely. Oh, sorry. Snapbacks, snapbacks. Yeah, yeah. So, so let me start on? off. How was your day? Oh, so far so good, man. How about yours? I think, I think you know. Every day is a blessed day because, you know, we're alive, so. Of course. I, I feel that. I you feel know what I'm that. saying? Like, every day is a blessing. So, you know, I had a great day. Of course. Me too, man. And, and now actually, I'm even, like, happier. I actually happy just woke up not too long ago. And it's, it's crazy. You said, what? My bad, bro. No, I'm saying now is even better because now we're going to get to talk about, about sneakers. Oh, yeah. yeah, for sure. So let's get into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but before we begin, uh, do you just want to introduce yourself to everybody? Um, you know, tell everybody who you are. You know, because this is a this is a platform that we can use. You know, where mm -hmm. a we're we're all sneakerheads. B we're all about the culture, and C you know we're all we're all we're all in this together right. to grow right. to grow together. And this is the only way to do it is word through mouth because you know the people around us. Unfortunately, they they don't really like. I don't want to say believe, but they don't. Push. I know. I, I know what you're trying to say. Though. They don't yeah. push. They don't push for us. Like yeah. I'm not saying. Look, buy a T-shirt. Support doesn't come it's, in the form of money. Support, support goes could be any form, but like a like a share. Like you don't know say mentioning it to somebody else, just sharing the news, anything. You know. What Listen, I'm saying? all you gotta do is like the post, and we'll be good. That's it. You know? 
You know what I'm saying? It ain't got to be no more, you know, more complicated than that. So, yeah. But yeah, feelings. let's tell everybody who you are. Uh, well, my, I go by Pure Flow. Uh, I'm a hip-hop artist, an entrepreneur. I make beats. Um, yeah, man. So I love the sneak sneakers. Um, I'm a big hip-hop uh, head. So, yeah, man. That's yeah, a little bit about me. I'm, I'm in Mesa, uh, Arizona right now. So Mesa, Arizona. Are you originally from Mesa, Arizona? No, nah, I, uh, um, I was born in California, Santa Ana, California, but just recently moved here from Chicago a couple years back. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, so I've only been here for about maybe two and a half years. I like it, though. It's decent. Yeah. yeah, it's chill. Yeah, it's pretty chill. The weather's it's hot as hell, but... It's hot you know, as hell. <laughs> yeah, but it's, <laughs> it's not bad, though. It, it's manageable. Yeah. No, I get that. I mean, you know... Uh, I get, you know, you used to live in California, but then sometimes you just got to go elsewhere to, like, start, you know, oh, your yeah. whole these journey. Yeah, I done lived a little bit of everywhere. I done stayed in Florida, Texas, um, Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia. Facts. That's dope. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's dope that you got into, like, travel and, like, got to see, you know, a little bit of the USA. Yeah. But, yeah, um... Let's just not waste time. You know, everybody came here for something. And for that's, the sneaks. Let's get to and it. And let's just get to it. Like, I'm just, like, super excited. So, the question for me is, how old were you when you got into shoes? Like, oh, man. See, I always loved shoes, like, since I was a kid. And, you know, growing up, you know, it, coming from a household where you can't really, uh, you know, afford stuff like that. But you, you always had the little passion for, you know, fashion and shoes. So me being an adult now, I kind of just, like, went kind of crazy. But, like, when I was able to, like, buy my own stuff, that's when my passion started. So, like, I want to say, like, 17. That's when I actually was able to, like, um, I guess you want to say, like, uh, start my, uh, my journey into the, you know, collecting shoes and stuff like that so. no, i definitely i definitely get where you're coming from because you know i definitely started at an older age too you know once i you know once i started my first job like 16 17 around that age yeah, yeah. King, i used to sometimes like starve myself to just buy sneakers just like, <laughs> it'd be like that though it's like you gotta have it especially yeah because jobs. you know back in the day like you really you really wanted those shoes but like you know i, I was on my mom but like yeah. you know I have to look at the bigger picture. Like, she would just tell me, like, look, mm -hmm. son, we're saving up to buy a house. And I wouldn't understand it. Yeah, being until... a kid, you wouldn't understand that. Yeah, yeah, I was a kid. I was just, like, confused. I was just like, damn, but why like, all these yeah. kids and like, yeah, how these kids is my age? Kid. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. But I feel like, you know, it, it it's not really, like, a big deal, you know, that you, know, you can't get it then. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, it's all material. Yeah. At the end of the day, it's just you know, it's just you like what you like. So. Yes. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. And that's what I. I mean, that's what I. That's what I love to hear. You like what you like right. because you know I. I really get tired of just seeing the same the same shoes over and over again. I mean, but I mean, yeah. it is what it is. Yeah. That's uh, when the, uh, you want to know something though. That's when the, the shoe the shoe game got kind of crazy though. After like. I guess people started realizing that too, and then they just started making more like exclusive drops. You know what I'm saying? Like drops where people, too many people can get to it, or like you know how they do raffles for certain sneakers and stuff like that, and like they'll make it to where like only a certain crowd of people will be able to get this this certain type of sneaker. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean it's very unfortunate. You know, others there's other people that could honestly get like a a bunch at one time and some people can't even like get the opportunity to get that shoe. Right. Yeah. So what was like the first shoe that like really set it off for you? Like really was like, wow, like this hmm. shoe was amazing. You want to know something funny? Which one? I'm not really a big fan of Jordans like that. No, that's fine. You know, you know how everybody just so Jordan crazed. Oh, they so could go crazy over the J's. I love but all I like kinds J's. of shoes. I don't discriminate. Yeah, right. That's what I'm saying. I like all kinds of shoes. But like um I wanna say the um, um the up tempos. 
the Nike up to You know what I'm saying? Those are some, some heat. Now, I want to say the colorway that I like is the red and white, then the gold and black. Those is pretty decent. Honestly, that's probably one of the top silhouettes of all time. Yeah. Because you can never go wrong. You can never go wrong with one of those. Definitely. And it's kind of unfortunate know. because I don't have one of those in my collection. I know, right? It's like, what size shoe do you wear? So, so basically, I'm usually like a 10 and a half, right? Oh, okay. But sometimes shoes, you. like, they, they run vary. weird, so yeah. I get an 11. Oh, got you. I got you. So I'm in, I'm in like the 9 and a half, 10, 10 range, depending yeah. on what type of shoe, like you said. But it's like I can never find like <laughs> air tempos in my size. Air up, the up tempos in my size for some reason. That's why I asked you. Like, is that a reason why you don't have it in your collection right now, or is? Just... I, I think that I think that is a yeah. honestly yes because I sleep. I sleep. Yeah. You know, like for yeah. Jordans, like I'm a I'm alert. I'm awake. Ah, oh, fucking, fucking okay, the tempos. I fucking yo that colorway is high. I go and I check, and I'm like, damn, my size. Yeah. Is not here. But you never pull yourself to actually buy it though. Yeah, but I definitely want to add one of those to my collection. Um, yeah, for sure. Definitely want to add one of those because I'm I'm really into um, I'm really into like basketball shoes. Yeah. So too. that's like a solid like basketball shoe right there. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I agree. So what would you say is like the whole the holy grail, like for you, your holy grail? My holy grail? Let me see. I'm about to show you. Okay, let, let's see. Let's see. We're about to get we about to get we crazy got, up in here. The okay. Air Max Vapors. Okay. Okay. I love, I love how they just combine each Air Max together. You know what I'm saying? Woo! Like, these bad boys right here. Yo, those are fire. I've never even seen those in my Are life. Are you serious, my man. I've never seen those in my life. Let me see. Yes. Oh, like those are fire. Ah, uh, these will be my holy grails. I barely even wear these, bro. I try to keep them so crispy. Look at what? the bottom. I probably only wear when these did like those, three times. When did those come out? When uh, did those I wanna come out? say 2020, maybe 2019, or somewhere around there. But yeah, it come with the little booklet of all the shoes that it's mixed with. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty dope. My mind is blown. So how many shoes, how many shoes is that makes? How many shoes? Do you know? I want to say, let me see. Uh, Probably like four So it started five. from, let me see. I want to say 10 pairs. Wow. I want to say 10 different, crazy. 10 different pairs of Air Max. Yep. That is crazy. Crazy. I've never seen that in my life. Yeah, you see how they got the box? My mind is blown. The packaging is crazy. Yeah. They just combined the, all kinds of packaging together. Yeah, that was on my desk, bro. I had to crazy. get crazy. Shout out to everybody joining us tonight. Yeah, thanks. Shout out to all of y'all. Sure. But yeah, man, that, that's my holy grail. This is my holy grail right here. And I understand it. That, and that colorway is fire. It's kind of like an Olympic, Olympic yeah. colorway. Yeah, and I got a fire ass like uh Mitchell in this jacket that you could just it just crush go with it. You know what I'm saying? Like oh, it's fire. It's oh fire. my god, thank you so much for showing me that to me because oh, I've crazy. never seen those. That's crazy. I thought everybody would have been seen these boys. I guess I yeah. I guess I'm slow with it. But yeah, man. So you wanna show everybody your top your favorite shoes from your from your collection? Oh yeah, okay. Let's so go, that's one of them. Go. That's one of them. I got these. Now I'm a fan of the the um the dunks in the Jordan ones. So like this is one of my favorite pairs right here. The Travis Scotts. Yeah, these bad Woo! boys. Very first fire. Man, you wanna know how I came up on these, bro? No lie to you. I found these boys at a pawn shop. No. 100 bucks for these boys. No. Somebody crazy, right? Look at these words. What the hell? At a pawn shop? At a pawn shop, bro. That's crazy. So that's one of the best one of them. 
That's my second favorite pair. Let me see. Then I got the. Uh, I'm a big fan of Air Max. I love Air Max. Cause Air, I mean Air Max is not comfortable. Yeah, they are. So I got these right here, the Air Max 90s. Air Max 90s. Let's go. These boys got the cork incorporated. Oh, that's the navy and the cork. The navy and the cork. Yeah. That's fire. Hell yeah. That's fire. I do so see. I think they. I think they're gonna drop like some dunks that are like cork or something. Yeah, I think I, I had seen something like that. Yeah, I'll be, I uh, I'll be following with, like sneaker news and um, what's the other one? Hype beats. Yeah. You heard of them before? Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, sneaker news. That's the one that I use for when I like. I want to find out what website is gonna drop it. Yeah. Show. Right. That's where I'm at. Yep, exactly. And then let me see. Gotta have a Nike Bay pair right here. These boys, I need to touch them up a little bit. Yeah. Those are five. Those are 97, right? Yeah, Airbags 97s. Yep. Those are mad comfortable. Yeah, I know. I love Air Max. Air Max is very, very comfortable. You can shoot, party in them, work in them, whatever you want to do. Shoot. Got the Jordan ones, the King and Rust colorway. Okay, what what? Are, I've never seen those. Are those the Zoom Comfort? Yeah, the Zoom Comforts. Okay, yep. okay, okay. Definitely. But this was the uh, this was a female colorway. Oh, that's the women. This the women's, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now that's fire, and you can never go wrong with a brown with with shades of brown. Oh yeah, for sure. I love nudes and browns and tans. I love, I love browns. Yeah. Yeah, man. How many shoes is that so far? Six. Oof. We had the first one's the Holy Grail, yeah, and then the second ones was the Travis Scotts. Then the third ones was the Air Max ninety seven. Wait, I think, oh, you showed me, sorry, the Air Max 90s and then the 97, and then the last ones you just showed. Was the, uh, uh the Jordan That's Adams. five. Okay, five. So we on the sixth pair right now. Yeah. More Jordan ones. This is the stadium green color way to. Oh, the, uh, yeah. Comfort, comfort zooms. I love these because they got the, the lime green on the bottom. I got to clean these, though. But yeah, yeah these mugs. It's yeah. one of my favorite pair, as you can see. So, so let me ask you: You do you own a pair of like regular Jordan ones to compare, like, like the like wait. how? Uh, I no. hear that, I hear these are more comfortable. These are. Uh, I like the regular ones. Like I was gonna get the Golden Rod ones, the Golden Rod Jordan ones. You know which ones those is, but I actually like how these, like you said, they 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 more comfortable. And hits the name Comfort. So <laughs> it's all like, you know, it's living up to his name. So <laughs> and I feel like that I feel like that's the problem that's the problem with like Jordan shoes that they're not as comfortable as like, you know, like Yeezys. Oh, know, like, yeah. I had a pair of those. I had sold them though. I had the oak the um the oak color wig. Yeah. The, yeah. the the first one? No, the ones that just came out, like I think they came out in twenty one. 2021. Oh, the, the like Wave a, Runners? I think that's what they was called. It was like a oak, like like bluish, like they was a tan color shoe with like blue and like I want to say peach color throughout it. Yeah, I think I think those are the 700s. Yeah, the 700s. Yep. <clears throat> yeah. Let's see. Yeah, Yo, I like your setup in the back. Appreciate you, bro. That's yeah, your yeah. that's your room. Yeah, it's my room. That's yep. dope. That's dope. I like the posters and stuff. Thank you. But yeah, man. Let me see. I got a couple more I want to show y'all. Yeah, let's yeah. Let's show us. Show us. Show everybody, cause you know I'm after big... this, I'm gonna upload this to my YouTube channel. For sure. I... For sure. So yeah. But um, I'm a big Nike fan, of course. So. These little Air Force ones. Okay. You know. Okay. The, uh, Those are the high top, right? Yeah, the high top, the seventy fifth anniversary. 
NBA joints. Okay, okay. They're pretty dope. Nah, those are fire. They kind of they kind of remind me of the, the Bread Jordans a little bit. How the material made and stuff. <clears throat> All right. Yeah. We got some some new balance. Let me see what these is the. I think these is the two. We yeah, had two O twos. Okay, okay. Those are New Balance. Yeah. Those look super comfortable. They are definitely comfortable to walk in. You can stand up in them for a long time. For sure. Right, right. So you got you got versatility in your collection. You got, yeah, I like a lot of. You got Air Maxes, a little bit of Air Maxes, a little bit of, yeah. like a little a bit of, of New Balance. That is dope. Yeah, yeah, man. Uh, the last one I got to show y'all. Shout out to King Ace. She is a really good artist. King Ace, thank you. King Ace. Thank you for telling me that. I And I can tell. And I can tell. What's so, up with you, bro? Appreciate that. That's your people? Yeah, that's my people. All right, all right. Shout out to King Ace for representing. Shout out to for joining us tonight. For sure. All right, so we all we know we got to keep some some Reeboks in the collection. Those classics. Let's go. I was waiting for somebody to show some Reeboks. We got the AIs. Okay. You no. Know? These those some are bad fire. Ain't they though? Yeah, One those are favorite pairs. Yes. <laughs> Honestly, I you know I you know what? Fuck it. Might as well. Oh, see them the Transformer ones. Uh, Power yeah. Rangers. Power Rangers. Oh man, them hoes is hard as hell. Hell yeah. Oh, I like the detailing on the. Yo, back I love, love, I love, love, love Reebok. Yeah, Reebok is dope. I gotta get more in my collection. I yeah, just started yeah. getting. Them. I'm Yo, look at these. Look at these nice Reebok right Oh, see those is sick. I like those. Look at this. Sick, sick. You know what? Hold on. Let me show you. You ever seen these here right here, bro? Everybody, this is Reebok, um, Kier Moss, Frail, Fury. What's that? What's the name of those? Those are these are called Pier Moss Trail Fury. Oh, so basically, I like those. have you ever heard of Pier Moss? No, uh -uh. So basically, Pier Moss is a, is a clothing brand. It's like you know, like that. It's like kind of like a high end, like fashion brand. Is uh, like, you know, uh, black black owned by uh, oh, his really? name is Kirby, and you know he's a designer, and yeah. um, you know he did this collab with Reebok, and this is the collab. I like those. Yeah, you gotta put the link in the description on those. I, <laughs> I, will. I like I them. Right there. I got you. Hell I mean, yeah. they're hard to find, but you know, I got you. Yeah, I really, really like those. Those are really, is that the only colorway they came in? Actually, yeah. they, there's a couple of colorways. Yeah. They have like the black and yellow. They have like gray and orange. They have That's a couple cool. of colors. It's just very underrated, bro, because like this yeah, is like that. Like, it's like kind of like a futuristic type. You know, a lot of people ain't on that wave. You know what I'm saying? They don't like the different type of. You exactly. know what I'm saying? I like crazy looking shit. So I feel like that's everybody why just wants to wear either Air Forces, Dugs, or like Travis Scott's, or yeah, and like you said, versatility in shoes. Like versatility. Mm -hmm. And there's the, woo. What are those? Reebok. Fire. Can I see the front? Ooh, ooh, those are sexy. <laughs> ooh. <laughs> Sorry, That's I get excited. I get excited when I see the like, Reebok silhouettes. Like, it's... right? That's why I was just about to say, like, I like the weird looking stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't even look weird, but it's like, you know. See, I feel like if me and you go to a party right now, you wear yeah. those. I wear these. Oh, we'll, we'll be, be like the endless duel. Shut shit down all the way. You already know. <laughs> but yeah, man, I got these and I got them in gray. Like they like three shades of gray. I had to get two pairs though. Those are fired. You yeah, gotta man. you gotta send me the link to those. Yo, we'll, we'll exchange links. Oh back. yeah, for sure. These is called the Zig 3D Storm Hydros. 
That's Shout out to King cool. Ace. Thank you for following. Oh, sure. Those are fire. Yeah. That's the box they come in. Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. I got a couple more up here. Uh, let me see. I like them. I like them. Okay, so I, I decided against the Golden Rod dunks to get these. I mean, the Golden Rod Air Force, the Jordan 1s to get the the dunks. I feel like the color looks a lot better that's the that's yellow and black right yeah, yeah the gold and black ones yep black and yellow <clears throat> black and yellow black and yellow, black and yellow. yellow. <laughs> uh -huh. but yeah man yo fire fire i love i love the versatility thank you thank you like those you showed me though those are super hot i love those thank you i appreciate you i'm sure man yeah so any uh, so so right now you um is there any shoe that like you want right now uh to be honest with you i ain't really been seeing nothing nothing Crazy, too high right? drop lately yeah you know what i'm saying nothing that i'm like oh i gotta have it you know it's been it's, yeah honestly last year it was a better year as far as shoes two drops yeah i agree with that and in 2020 they dropped some pretty dope shoes too and i'm a lot Honestly, I feel like I, I hopefully I feel like it might be even worse in 2024, but who knows? Like, you know. Yeah, <laughs> right. Like, I don't know. I just feel like it's getting it's kind of getting boring now because it's just like mm -hmm. we need like new like new silhouettes, like new Yeah, new new designers, new like if you said new silhouettes. And like just, they even it's try to combine repetitive. some more silhouettes together, like they did with the Vapor Max. You know what I'm saying? Combine some shit try some off the wall you know like i used to want to be a, a um a shoe designer that's another reason why like i have a passion for shoes i'm a sneakerhead like um i always had a passion for clothes and shoes and stuff like that so i got my own clothing line that's what the this poster is right here the better days ahead that's the name of my clothing line that's oh the logo. okay but all right, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna tag you and we're gonna tag your 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 clothing line and if if any other like business you wanna let me know if you wanna tag, you know we let everybody know because you guys you know show some love to Pure Flow if you yes, guys yes, show thank love to Line you guys thank gotta show love to Pure Flow yeah for sure for sure yeah man so we're doing big things out here we're, you know doing big things we're moving. We're not sleeping. We're not <laughs> sleeping, you know? Oh, we wait. We wide awake, goddamn. We team no sleep over here. So sure. yeah, on a scale of one to ten, how much do you like lug shoes? Oh, I think it's off the Richter scale. <laughs> oh, above ten. I love shoes, bro. Like like you said, like I'll I'll probably buy a pair of shoes before I get a meal type shit. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I don't I fuck with shoes that much. So I feel you, I feel you. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. So do you have like a ballpark of like how many shoes you have in your collection right now? Uh, I want to say almost forty pairs. I think it's like like thirty-seven to thirty-eight, something like that. Okay. okay so not okay. too many. It ain't too outrageous but, like most people. <laughs> nah, listen. I mean, I, I feel like I feel like if you have like enough for like two weeks, mm -hmm. three weeks, mm -hmm. I think I think you're good. Yeah, I agree. Because you know that it's all about that rotation, like that right. rotation. Right, you got a uh, like if you got a signature pair that you always go to, you know, something that you can rock with everything. Like you can't go wrong with like a, a classy pair of white Air, Air Forces that go with everything. You know what I'm saying? Or a classy white pair of Reeboks or something like that. You know, it depends on your style, really. Like whatever, you know, whatever you like. So, facts, facts, facts. So, my question to you is. You just showed me Nike. You just showed me New Balance. You just showed me Reebok. Yeah. So many brands. But what is your favorite brand? My favorite brand will be Nike. I won't lie to you. Nike, hands down. Always been a big Nike fan. Yeah. And I feel like so far, it's always been Nike. Yeah. <laughs> Nike. I mean, Nike got it. Got everybody wrapped around their fingers. Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, and this is why I'm using Nike to get everybody to Enline. Uh, ain't nobody gonna be like, what yeah. the hell is Enline? You know what I'm saying? I feel it. 
People want to be like sneakers. Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Let's see. <laughs> let's see. But hey, I like how you collaborate, you know, and in incorporating it, bringing it all together because it's all come full circle. The sneakers and fashion is it's like peanut butter and jelly. You know? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad. I'm glad that I'm able to invite you on this journey with me. Of course, I appreciate you for having me. For yo, sure. like truly blessed, truly blessed to have you here tonight. And I just have one last question for you. If yep. you had the opportunity to design your own shoe, what brand would you sign with? Come on, man. <laughs> you, what? You got to think about this. Okay, okay. okay. No, I'm, I'm going to be too hasty. I ain't going to be too hasty. Who are you going okay. with? Think Ooh. about it. You gotta think about. They're gonna give you design freedom. You know, you gotta think about it. Right. Who are you going with? Hmm. Adidas, Nike, you, New Balance, Reebok. I would have to say Nike, though. Okay. okay. I'm gonna have to say Nike. I'm not gonna lie to you, but Reebok would probably be another one, though. It would probably be another one. Have you ever uh, heard of this artist artist named Salehi Bimberry? Yes. So he designs for like Adidas and I think he started this. It, yep, there you go. You got a pair of the shoes right there. He's a dope designer though. He's a dope designer. And he started out working at like Payless or some shit, trying to get his foot in the door. And he started designing for like Versace and all of them. And I feel like they gave him a you know his creative space to do what he wanted you know what I'm yeah because he so he designed shoes with new balance right that's what it yeah was. now new now new balance yeah right yeah because he used to do for like versace yeah versace but mm -hmm. i think new balance creative. was when it was like his like own shoe yeah right pretty much his own creative design he actually you know what i'm saying the whole architecture of it but yeah i think that's pretty dope so either yeah, Nike or or so or or Reebok for me though. That's dope. And yeah. and would you like create a whole new shoe or would you like work off a silhouette? Because I know you like the um up tempo. Um yeah. would you work like off a silhouette, like kind of what like all these people that have done like Travis Scott, like they work off a silhouette, or would it be like a new shoe? I think that's cool that they do that, but I would like to try to do something new. Cause like you said, we need some fresh out here in the shoes. It's getting boring. We need some different type of styles, silhouettes. So, you know, I feel like everybody doing the, the com combination. You know what I'm saying? So start from scratch with something, something fresh. You know? That's dope. That's dope. That's dope to hear. Yeah. But yeah, man. Like, um, I have so much fun doing this. Like, yeah, me too, man. I appreciate you. For and I really here. hope. Hope that maybe sometime I'll be able to go to Arizona or oh, or yes. maybe wh wherever you at we link up and sure. I always vibe. You come to New York. I've never been to New York, so East Coast. What? So you already know the vibes. If you come to New York, you already know. Oh, and yes. NYC got you. You already right, know. for sure. I'll hold you to it, man. Smoke from fast spliffy. Oh, yeah. You know, sure. Take you to the you... grub spot. You oh, yeah. Know. I know y'all got some good food out there. Peace. Oh, that is Good yeah, grub yeah. and good times. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Um, thank you everybody for tuning in. You guys sure. really know. Follow Pure Flow. I'm going to tag her right now. And yeah, her clothing you. brand. You, uh, you got to show me your clothing brand so I can tag it. Oh, yeah. Got, um, thank you everybody you. For, for joining. If you want to say anything, Pure Flow. Oh, yeah, yeah. I thank y'all for tuning in. Appreciate y'all, man. Um, Follow me. I follow back. You know, I want to support everybody that support. And um, yeah, y'all take care, man, and thanks for tuning in for sure. Yo, thank you, thank you so much for 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 joining me, and have a have a blessed night. I know Let's you gotta go to work. I gotta put these kids yeah. to sleep. Life goes on. <laughs> life, life is life goes yep. on. Thank you so much. Thank yeah, you, everybody. Have a good you night. Have a great night. All right, y'all. Peace. Peace.